Welcome back to night six. Who is that? Is anyone coming up with these stupid questions? Most likely, yes. Okay. So we're in a clock tower, obviously, there's gears, there's stained glass windows, so I guess it's like some sort of church clock tower. Anna. And that's all I'm noticing from the environment. Alright. Upward we go. Here I am. You in there, buddy? We can talk once you sit down. Is it just me or does that picture seem to have more sheep than it did before? Wait. It's a sacrificial painting. Does the person who gets to the top have to die for the sake of every other sheep? If so, that would just kind of be dickish. It is Atlas though. They are fairly well known for having a high rate of protagonist mortality. And that's kind of putting it lightly. They kill off protagonists like nobody's fucking business. Really good. You've been going at a pace of one floor per night so far. Come on, hurry up and ask your question. I want to get this over with tonight. This is the eighth question. Are you able to show all of the contents of your cell phone to your significant other? Ha 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 ha. Ah. Which one? This puts me at an interesting point because I. Strangely enough, do not currently possess a cell phone. I have sort of no reason to. If I were to substitute, say, computer for cell phone, oh, no. then, yeah, actually I sort of have on occasion. They have been a little oh. bit weirded out if they chose to take me up on that offer because, well, to put it lightly, I do have a significant pornography collection. <laughs> significant. And some of that stuff does get a little weird. Fortunately, I tend to date uh, pretty cool chicks, so. Which one? Yeah. Ah, uh, but in Vincent's case, it's a definite no. I mean, we've seen his text messages, am I right? He cannot show that shit to Catherine. I don't know. And I doubt he'd want to show it to the other Catherine either. you before that there is someone who put you here Can't be. whatever this place is isn't it a dream that's why even the smallest of fears and doubts become magnified here <laughs> remember that I don't quite get what he's saying is he saying that yeah, it's fucked up because it's a dream, but how does that apply to somebody sending us here? Slightly more would say, of course. Kind of surprises me. I think a lot of people actually value their privacy. Me? I don't really give a fuck. I mean, sooner or later, they're going to stoop. I grew up in a house full of people. I know what happens when you have a lot of people in close quarters with you. They look for stuff. So you can either be upfront about it, or you can wait for them to stumble across it themselves. I prefer to just get it out of the way. But obviously not everybody would agree with that. And hey, there are some people who wouldn't snoop and, you know, my girl isn't like that. Oh please, everybody's girl looks through their phone when they're got to the bathroom. Ladies, do not fucking pretend you don't do it. And dudes, do not pretend you don't do it either. Every fucking one of you bastards do it. I know, I have friends, I've seen that shit go down. Dudes will rummage through their girl's purse. I'm sure several of you have probably caught your significant other doing one or the other. There are two types of bomb blocks with different blast radii. How brightly they glow will help you figure out which is which. Let me guess, the ones that grow, glow brighter blow up bigger. 
So obviously that's how you get the trophy. Find the ones that. Not gonna die. Commencing area two. Okay, that one that's going with red and blue, that's obviously the one that blows up big. I kind of want to get my hands on it. I just want to detonate one of these. Just because. Oh, that was kind of stupid of me. Really? That's Whatever, you know what I mean? Looks like Vincent's new to the explosions. Good to know. Good to know. Exactly, do I deal with this cluster fuck? <laughs> Seriously, somebody tell me. How the fuck am I supposed to deal with this cluster fuck? Yep. This is a goddamn mess. And this is going to get worse before it gets better. And I'm dead. May you rest in peace. Love is over. Love is so fucking over. Love is so over you don't even fucking know man. I have a feeling that isn't what I was supposed to do. It seemed like it was to me though. I was like, damn, that kind of looks exactly like what I was supposed to be doing. Then I did it and I was like, oh wait, no, that, that totally does not look right at all. Actually, none of this looks right. The fuck am I doing? Okay, that's the limits of my undoes. I am undone. Okay, I'm definitely seeing why this is considered a hard section. Most certainly, good sir. Why do I feel like I just walked myself into a dead end? Because I did. Okay, obviously I'm just going to have to kill myself. I have failed you, master! And down I go. More careful planning, less fucking around. Round two, let's go! No wait, I do not want that block anywhere near me. Okay, let's try to strategically plan around some of these blocks. Edge. 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 
like so. Not sure how much this is gonna work. Okay! Looks like planning strategically actually worked pretty well. Nice. Are you fucking serious? Oh god, you're fucking serious. You are not serious. You cannot fucking be serious. That is a goddamn vertical wall. Look at this shit. That motherfucker's goddamn vertical. Oh, I am so disappointed in you. Me and your mother are very disappointed. Very disappointed. I'm just gonna use the heavy blocks because I don't feel like fucking around with the other ones. I got plenty of elbow room. Because I'm not playing on hard mode. If you're playing on hard mode while well, you're fucked. Which I probably should be doing because apparently the only way to get full completion of the game is to actually play on hard mode. Because one of the trophies is for getting gold on every puzzle on hard mode. And. Dear God, I am kind of scared for that because that sounds pretty goddamn terrifying, to be honest. Okay, I'm gonna have to start getting really creative here in a second. Nope. Did not go as I pictured it. Did not go as I pictured it at all. Cool, it's a spring block. Too bad that doesn't work to my advantage right now. I just want to use these regular blocks. Hopefully it doesn't act like a complete douche. And oh god damn it. I fucked up that, didn't I? I really fucked that up. I fucked up really bad. Oh, you stop that. You stop that right now. You stop that. God damn it. No, you bastard. Do not make me do this. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't care. I don't fucking care. Alright. Oh man, it's a tower. Fucking hell! Why are these climbs all so goddamn vertical? Every fucking one! Let's 
It's like, they can't be horizontal. No, that would be easy. No, we gotta make these motherfuckers vertical. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. So I'm just gonna keep going back as far as I can. And just hope for the best. Okay, trophies obviously happens. Sadly, it doesn't look like I'm actually going to get through this. Because I am so goddamn confused right now, I do not know what the fuck I should be doing. No. Mash the undo button till you win. Oh, that's how I fucked up last time. You ain't getting me twice with the same goddamn trick, you bastards. Gotta do this quick. Alright. I think we got it. I think we got it. No, I don't think we got it. I do not think we got it at all. Something here is off. Something here is very, very far off. None of these towers look to be right. Let's get up there. Uh huh. Okay. Hey, who? I am pretty close to the top, I think. I just cannot seem to figure out. Oh, well, yeah, I could have done that quite a while ago, couldn't I? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna try shifting everything over like one block. Can't die here. No! No! Oh, I thought I had something. I was definitely working on something there. It just didn't pan out. Rest in peace. Now's not the time to be dead. I take back everything I said. They've definitely amped this area up. Well then. That's what I should have done the first time. I'm an idiot. I realize this. I realize this every minute of every day. It's just how much of an idiot I am.
God damn, what the fuck am I doing? Obviously not the smart thing. What is the smart thing? I wish I fucking knew. I could tell you for damn sure it's not what I'm doing. I'm sure they're going to bring that trick up at some point. Where I just alternated those columns. Or not. That's also a possibility. Get out of here. All of you, get out of here. There we go. Going up to get this first. So I'm out of items. And I just know there's going to be some trick for getting between columns. It's gonna come up in a second. I hope I'm figuring it out. So right now I'm just knocking out the supports and switching over to the other side. I mean it seems to be working fine for me, but I'm sure somebody's going to be like no, there's actually a smarter way. And then I'm gonna feel like the world's biggest dumbass. Because everybody knows the right thing to do except me. Come to Papa. Best pyramid ever. Up we go. Oh wow, there's another checkpoint? Really? Oh, it is pretty hard, so I guess it's pretty welcome. Is that a goddamn soda? Looks like a fucking Pepsi. That's a fucking Pepsi. They make you climb like crazy. I hope I'm doing this right, because I'm not so sure. I am actually quite worried that I am fucking something up here. Legitimately scared. But hey, where's the fun in feeling secure, am I right? Okay, a bridge for myself. Trying to keep the platform as long as possible. There's a lot of large vertical climbs up in this bitch. Mm, looks like if I get over there, I can climb across the top. Jackpot! That section made me think. That section really made me think. It was pretty intense. I dig that shit. I dig that shit over hardcore. Really have Good. I'm also liking the music for this area. Can't say I'm a huge fan of the soundtrack on the whole. I mean... 
uh, this particular composer has been responsible for some really beautiful music over the years. And, I don't know, personally, I don't think that's... Orlando? I heard all over. It's motherfucking Orlando! Check it out, bros! It's motherfucking Orlando! Up in the nightmare scape. Guess I was right! Some of these people are in that situation. Um, as I was saying, uh, composer responsible for some really great music, but while this game doesn't have a bad soundtrack, it's just personally not uh, resonating with me quite so well as some of the other work. I don't know. Maybe it's just not fitting together or right with the scenery or something. It does have a couple of good points, but all in all, not quite the greatest. I know that was probably supposed to be incredibly scary, but that was the corniest fucking thing I have ever heard. Ever. Whoa. I mean, I'm sorry. The voice acting in Atlas's games are quite good, sometimes to the point where they're um, absolutely exceptional, but that was... What the fuck was that? That was just... I want to talk to Orlando. I want to see what the fuck he's doing here. So Orlando sleeps in his hat and leather jacket. <laughs> okay. Actually, I think I might know you. Never mind. God damn it! You two should team up and take on this tower together. I heard all over. <sighs> all right. Hey, look! There's light shining through the windows. Wow. Can you see what it looks like outside? Wow. They should throw a rock at the windows just to see what would happen. Hey look, it's a giant phallic object. Man, I heard all over. Ah, I was hoping they were keeping the theme going. Usually if there's a male symbol on one side, there's a female on the other, like that one dungeon. Anna, That's not. I've decided to let others help me. So I can reach true freedom. I'm going to climb. For Anna. Why do people fall in love? What? Some people say that you find that romantic spark when you encounter someone who compensates for your own flaws. By doing so, you can find an idealized version of a personality completely opposite to yours through a romantic relationship. In a nutshell, you're trying to get rid of the self you hate through romance. Hmm. That actually makes some sense. I do feel like I'm a better person when I'm with them. I'm not empty anymore. I'm not the me who can't do anything. So maybe that's why we fall in love. To accept who we are and live our lives. That makes romance seem awfully trivial. Not really. Just because there's an unusual reason behind it doesn't make it Anna. pointless. I'm going to climb. For Anna. <sighs> what is this dream anyway? They say it's about cheating, but I've never cheated. I see. So what's really going on? Have you cheated? Yeah. There's a survey saying that 70% of men in relationships cheat. That makes me a minority. But just so you know, 40% of women cheat. It's the truth. Huh. You know, it's funny. <laughs> I've actually known more women who've cheated than men. <laughs> I'm not sure I can trust the validity of this survey. I'm going to have to see some facts. Me personally, 
I have never cheated. Although, I have been in some unusual circumstances. Unusual, unusual circumstance. Long story. Only that many. Study claims that people attempt to create relationships resembling those of their pasts. Your childhood relationship with your parents, previous romantic relationships, that's what people are yearning for when they search for love. Okay, so what? Huh? Or, uh, I'm sorry. Ha! Huh. <laughs> I'm concerned about that. My past relationships have been horrible. Yeah. I've been in like one good relationship, one okay relationship. One absolutely terrifying relationship. All right. As for my parents, I hate one of them. <laughs> Completely hate. That's gonna be interesting. Obviously, I'm a masochist of some kind. Anyway, not cheating is the best course of action. It's a momentary thrill, but it costs so much more. You know what I mean? True that. Ain't worth it. Anna. Plus, considering the kind of shit it puts the other person through, not a very nice thing to do. Which is why I would never do that to anybody. Because it fucking sucks to be on the other end. It's coming again tonight, isn't it? Hey, what is it for you? A little different things. Some kind of baby. Hands. Stuff. It really does vary person to person, huh? In my case, it's my mother. Coming after me, to take me back, to lock me away. I managed to get away that day, but I've been running all this time since then, and now I, I don't want to return to that life. I need to keep techniques in my mind. I need to keep running. Hang in there, man. Yeah, you go, Otacon. Don't let your mama fuck you no more. I heard all over. And then your dad dies. Seriously, fucking Japan. What the fuck is with you people? Mm. I have a feeling his mother is like ridiculously overbearing and probably like kept him locked up. There was probably some sexual abuse or something. Mm. I have a feeling we'll find out in a couple of days. I, I don't want to return to that life. I need to keep techniques in my mind. I need to keep running. Hang in there, man. Oh, and obviously it's not just people who cheat. I don't even think Orlando is seeing anybody, so it could just be people who are having like really ridiculous relationship problems. It's completely batshit problems. Ew. Things are getting tough around here. You can't always rise to every situation, but you can only fall to the level of your training. And Morgan. His wife is dead. I don't see how he could be cheating unless he has a girlfriend that he never talks about. He doesn't strike me as the sort, though. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change my perception to it's probably some sort of you have girl problems, so deal with your nightmares thing. I'm sure there's probably some meaning to those symbols on the window, but I can't really see them too well. I could just make out a heart. A couple of hearts, really. Like what? Try this one on for size. Allow me to explain. Bombs away. After activating a bomb block, quickly move it away from the area. If you push the bomb block off an edge before it explodes, the blocks around it will not be damaged. That seem useful to you? Very. Spoil. Have you seen this one? Allow me to explain. Spoil. When you get on a spring block, you can jump upwards five blocks. You can move spring blocks. So use this knowledge to propel your skills to new heights. Yeah, I should have tried doing something like that with the spring blocks I had in that uh, puzzle before the last one or whatever. Oh well. Nice. You're brilliant. 
All right, what's next? That sounds pretty useful. I expect nothing less of you. And he's just gonna ask me to review. I just fucking know it. Man, I heard all over. Um, just doing a lap to make sure I got all the dialogue. I heard all over. Not that there's any specific reason. I just like knowing as much of the story as possible. Who thinks this is all a game? Do you want to play a game? Hey. How many times do I have to tell you? Sit down. Whatever, Pharos. Oh, man. Huh. Seems you're getting used to the machine based traps as well. Hey. What's up with those sheep that attacked me? Ah, yes. There are many sheep like that now. They've lost their sanity. If you lose your mind, all you have left to lose is your life. They don't exist in the real world anymore. Are you serious? This is the ninth question. If you begin to doubt your lover, would you reaffirm your trust in them? Or speak to them directly? <laughs> So those really big scary sheep are people who have gone so insane from these dreams that they no longer physically exist. This one? So are these people that have died or are these people that uh, just like vanish in their bed somehow? I think they're people who like vanish in their beds but there's no like news about oh there's a lot of people disappearing now. So that's kind of weird. But we do know that the people who wake up this from one? the weakening system, from the weakening sickness, and die, are people who have fallen off. Damn it, I don't know. Plot hole, or just me not getting to that information yet. Uh, which one? If I doubt them, reaffirm my trust or talk to them. I've always been a firm this believer one? in um, conversation. I believe that simply by talking to somebody, you can kind of resolve some issues. Even if it does make you look very, very crazy. Which it has. Again, long story, etc, etc. Just take my word for it. This one? Uh, so yeah. I'm a fan of talking it out. Reaffirm my trust. I don't know. That does seem like a good idea, but usually if there is some doubt there, um... I believe there's some sort of issue that might need to be, like, addressed somehow. And really, this if you're in, like, a good relationship, talking about something like this should not be a big deal. I mean, hell, I, don't know. I would think that they might very well have the same suspicions about you, on occasion. And it could clear the air. So, yeah, talk to them. Interesting. Oh, yes. You're in the middle of the clock tower stage. From the next section on, your trials will get longer and longer. But you're running out of time. Then hurry the hell up. I'll get out of here before the night is over. Very well. I'll take you to the next level. Oh, boy. They're going to start getting longer. More puzzles. Oh, boy. Oh, God. I hate myself. Okay, I absolutely love the puzzles. It's just... I don't know, I kind of want to advance the plot and... I'm fucking up so bad at these puzzles and I'm recording everything. I either gotta start doing them in advance or I gotta stop fucking up so much. I'm just gonna keep recording and fucking up on camera because that's how I roll. Most people would agree with me. And by talking to them, I do not mean some sort of heated uh, debate or angry confrontation. I just mean, I don't know, some discussion. You gotta be civil about this shit. Otherwise, it becomes an argument and shit happens and it's just messy as fuck. Oh, right. It's a race against time on this long staircase. This one has one, four areas. Huh. Okay, I was thinking it was three. Use the items to your advantage 
and reach the door before you lose your footing. So it's a good idea to use the items this time. Noted. Just let me climb this tower like normal, damn it! Commencing area three. Are you ready? But where's the fun in that, Vincey boy? Yeah, I actually am trying to do something here. Probably not something smart, but I am trying to do something. Nevertheless. Victory! Oh wow, are you serious? You guys are motherfuckers. I hope you realize this, Atlas. You guys are gigantic... Bullshit, motherfuckers. Every last goddamn one of you. Is that a goddamn chunk of blocks made entirely of spikes? I reiterate, you guys are motherfuckers. Huge motherfuckers. Yeah, that's none of this is gonna work out. It's obviously a trick here that I'm not seeing. Yep. What's wrong with feeling? Okay, I'm sure there's like a better way to do this than the way I'm doing it. There's a good way to do this, and I ain't doing it that way, obviously. Obviously, see, I'm doing it the long and stupid way that only idiots do, and that's why I keep fucking up. Next level. What is that? That's a goddamn ant! Sorry. Holy shit! Okay! Um... I guess the ants are starting to show up! 
those witches and their goddamn messengers are starting to fuck with me directly. Well, more directly to the left. So dissatisfied with myself right now. Peace. Now's not the time to be dead. Whatever I did last time, I didn't do it right this time. Or did I? Actually, I did. Okay. Thanks for me. Coming out way too quick. You can't die here. Oh god, oh god, oh god, why? Oh god, why? No, 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 fuck. I'll get you someday, my pretties, and your little dogs too. Oh, your little dogs. They will be gone. They will be gone. Oh, yes, they will. We all think they won't be gone, because they will. God damn it. Ants! Ants! Breathing room. Here. Alright, I got it. Edge. Alright, I got it. Edge. Alright. Edge. 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 Right. Uh. Yeah, I had no idea what the fuck was going on there. No goddamn clue. May you rest in peace. Oh, I'm still on this area? Really? Oh boy. Yeah, let's just check my timer. And it's all right. You are so far behind schedule. I'm all right. 
dead. Off my blocks. Say to pick it. this? Fucking ads. I ain't gonna put up with your shit. Look at this tower more closely. There's got to be a better way to do this than the way I am. Well done. All right. I was going to use the pause menu to cheat the game out a little bit, but I remembered. Oh, they put a mosaic over it. Like it's Japanese porn or something. So, haha, -ha, no cheating. Smart move. Well played. Well played, my friends. I also do like, like how I just got killed. Now's not the time to be dead. Wait, how did I do that last time? Because that was fucking brilliant. I gotta do that again. Yes, that was it. Haha. Science. Zap the ass. Wait, hold on. Why don't I just do the exact same thing here? My god, I am so fucking stupid. I am ashamed to know me. I should just be doing the exact same thing the entire way up. Until this happens and it starts throwing me for a loop. Bingo! The higher up I go, the more space I have to move. So if I can get this going right, I should have enough room to actually move around a little bit and do some cool stuff. Like that. Okay, this looks like one of those ones where we have to get me. Yeah, I'm saying. 
Oh, nice. That's good too. Fuck. <sighs> I've got a lot of stuff worked out in my head. But I'll be damned if it's not actually coming out on paper. It's okay though, I figured out the trick to this shit. I feel so awesome. I kind of like that about puzzle games, like, as soon as you figure out the right way to do something, you're all like, Motherfucking Eureka, bitches! Then everything just slides into place. Love that. Only puzzle games can give you that feeling. Okay, maybe not just puzzle games, but... They're definitely one of the best ones for doing that. Yep. Slide, slide, slide. Say no to ants, kids. They will ruin your picnics. Okay, so obviously I'm supposed to do the same thing up there. It's just that there doesn't seem to be enough room on the left side to do it right. Okay, maybe there is. And I'm just an idiot. Or I fuck something up. I probably just fuck something up. That's gonna be my claim. I'm gonna stick to that claim. I fucked up so hard. There's a way that that was supposed to work, and I just completely fucked it up so goddamn hard. Oh shit, half the tower just collapsed. This does not bode well. Stupid motherfucking ant! Get off my shit! You bastard. You need to restock my lives after that! Um... I did something wrong. I totally did something wrong, didn't I? Right, I got it. Let's try it from the other side. We got this. We got this. Come on. 
Okay, maybe we don't got this. Oh yes, we do have this. Yes. We have this. We have this. We we got this. We got this. Come on. Oh you shit faced. You shit faced motherfucker. I hate you forever. Oh, you are fucking kidding me. Come on. Come on. Throw me a fucking bone here, people. Give me a goddamn break. Please. I fucking need this shit. Oh, you are kidding me. Come, come on. Come, come on, people. Come on. You, you can't do this. You can't do this to me. Come on. Okay, we can do this. We can do this, come on. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, God. That took a lot longer than it should have. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just that was too perfect. Like right at the end I was just like, fuck you, how could you do this to me? And then I realized what I was supposed to do and I was like, I'm so fucking stupid. Oh, oh my god, that I don't know. I do not fucking know. Just holy shit. Anyway, that took way longer than it should have. Especially that last area. But, I don't care. I do not fucking care. The boss fight is coming up very shortly. And, I am going to cut the recording off here. On that incredibly insane fucking note. Just... I don't know. <laughs>